YouTube, Jess, we're 101 back for one of two hat reviews today. That's right, two hat reviews. I'm going to start doing two a day. As you know, we're reviewing MLB on fields right now. Um, so, today's caps are the Arizona Diamondbacks caps that I have. Um, I've got, they don't really wear this at home anymore, but I do have the uh, their D hat with the gold trim around it. And the scarlet red. Their new alternate hat with the the black with the teal around the scarlet, which I think just looks awesome. And then, of course, you know, that's their normal alternate hat with the uh, gold around the scarlet. So, uh, yeah. Um, I'm going to show you something cool involving this hat. Don't be alarmed, but so we're going to review this hat first. So... You guys see the teal around the A, the A with the teal, and all the way around. Nice hat, right? Nice hat, right? Well, yeah, of course it's a nice hat. It's a Diamondbacks hat. But anyways, yeah. Um, then, you, black brim, oh wait, MLB logo, nice, you know, all nice and fresh. Black underbrim. New Era, fly your own flag. Don't be alarmed if you see this, okay? Seven and three eighths. Don't be alarmed if you see this. If it says made in the USA with imported materials, this is still real, folks. The major leaguers are walking around with this on. If it says made in China, then that's when you got to be concerned. Um, I had that letter of authenticity right there. I can. They called uh, the guy on it, and he told me that. This is still real. It's still considered made in America. So, if you see this, don't be alarmed. But yeah, very nice hat. Now, I'm going to use an example. If you see this, if you see this right here, then you need to be alarmed. See how it says made in China and the words are in gray? Well, yeah. And the, era, and the new era thing looks different? Well, yeah. That's when you should be concerned. It's not fake. Okay? It's just not as good quality. I just thought I'd let you know that. But yeah, that's when you should be concerned. So, anyways, back to these. So we just reviewed this one. Let's review this this one now. This one's older. I got this at a thrift shop for two bucks. So I mean, you you can't pass it up. I mean, it's it's real. It's legit. So if you see that, that is what the on-field cap symbol used to look like. Yes, this is blue. But if it's this kind of blue, this is older. Okay, this is older than 2009, so it looks like this. But as you see, it's made in USA, which makes it legit. It's got the new era emblem, official on-field cap, 5950. It's legit. So let's take that blue sign and compare it to to this bullshit. Or, or, excuse me, to this bull blue sign. That is not real. See, they tried to copy that to make you think it was real. But if you see that, that's real. You see that, that's not real. But these are only on the ones that are newer than 2009. Or older than two, 2009 and older. So, remember that. So, yeah. That hat is legit. Then, there's this one. Fish you on for your cap, fly your own flag, seven and three A's. Made in USA. I forgot to show you the MLB logo on that one, but uh back under brim. So yeah, those are the three Diamondbacks caps. Stay fly for stay fly and stay tuned for one more hat review. Stay fly. Jeff World 101 out. I'll see you guys later. Have a great one.